uh, from Insta Camera. Uh, it's a brand new developing pinhole camera. Uh, it's coming to Kickstarter soon. Um, it uh, takes photos in larges, negatives, uh, and it's also your dark room as well. So you don't need any other uh, stuff for this. The only thing you need is a dark bag uh, just to load the paper in, and you can develop uh, prints inside here. These are photographs taken with it as a, as a pinhole camera, and the white ones here, and these are enlargements that have been done uh, from, from a negative. So, um, this one now. So I'll just dry this up. So after you've taken the shot, you need to just dry it, dry the very bottom of the camera like this. Um, dry the tray out. Like so, and now that's ready for another another print. Um, so what we do now is we take this, uh, we put it in the dark bag down here. Yeah. yeah. This goes in the dark bag uh, with the paper. So, so what I'm doing now is I'm separating the camera body from the back. Open in my paper, paper box, uh, get my piece of paper out, uh, put it into the back of the, the camera back, and the body goes on the top. Like that. Uh, make, it, make sure you shut your, uh, your paper box, otherwise, you're going to end up with a load of ruined paper. And then Open it up. So now we've got paper in there ready to uh, to expose onto. Um, so take so this. What we do now is um, so there's the, the pinholes behind here, um, but instead of exposing uh, the pinhole uh, as if we were going to take a shot, we rotate it to the diffuser spot. Um, and what that does is that that's an opal diffuser. So we illuminate that with a light source, like so. And uh, my exposure time on the negative that's in there is six minutes. So we'll let that run for six minutes now, and then we can uh, develop the shot internally. We'll set a timer. So I'll set this timer off again because I want to develop that for one minute. What I usually do is put it in nice and slowly so it's not blasting around in there. Agitate as you put it in. And then just agitate that for one minute. You can actually use the bubble levels here as well to, to make sure that you've got it uh, you've got it flat while you're, you're developing. seconds that should do it for uh, demonstration purposes pull that out 
washing there. And then hopefully, And then I'll show you the negative. Stuff on there. Uh, that's 